us wrong not to go to Jake's memorial service. I don't know what to tell you, Jason. I mean, that's really not for me or anyone else to judge. Michael was there. And I, uh, I hope that helped, you know. All the people who love Jake coming together, talking about him, remembering him, maybe it gave Michael a new perspective on life. What, are you, are you still afraid that Michael wants to be in the business? I, I don't want him to throw his life away. Is that how you feel, Jason? Do you feel like you threw your life away by going to work for Sonny? What, what happened? Never mind me, just, you have to do something. Michael has a gun and he's gone after Brandon. What made Michael think he needed a gun? Brandon got hooked up with some lawyer who released him on bail. They were threatening to take the case to trial. You saw Brandon? G Michael and I. He showed up out of nowhere like he always does. Brandon said that his lawyer would argue that Michael attacked him without provocation. They will put Michael on the stand and they are going to bring up the fact that he's on parole and send him back to prison. So you dropped the attempted rape charges? I had to. There's no way I'm going to let him go back to that hellhole because he defended me. Okay. I, just, I need you to calm down, okay? I know he just showed up. Sam, I, th I thought it was Michael and you, and he just started telling okay, me that okay. we needed so, to be so, together. So what happened? You told Brandon to go away, he beat you up, and then Michael went and got the gun, yeah? I'm afraid he's going to use it. I screwed up. I thought I was protecting him, but I, I think I provoked him into murder. Uh-uh. Michael is not a killer. Sam, he was really mad if Michael finds Brandon right now. Uh-uh. You know, Jason will get there in time. Stop. Man. It all changed so fast. Michael and I were happy. We made love for the first time. And it was great. You know, and then we went out f for lattes, Michael wanted to buy me a present. So we were just teasing each other back and forth and then suddenly Brandon appeared. Started threatening Michael, threatening Dante. Dante, huh? According to Brandon's new version of the way things happened. I mean, after Michael attacked him for no reason, his cop brother came in and covered everything up. After which then Michael's rich parents paid me off to lie. How was I ever? with this man. What does that say about myself? Mm -mm. Don't do that. We all make bad choices. It's called living and learning, okay? This is a nightmare. Trust me, Jason's gonna take care of this. He's gonna make sure nothing happens to Michael. When Abby dropped the charges against you, she gave you a chance to walk away with your life. You choose to hit her. Sorry, sorry, who's the idiot? You're not gonna pull that trigger. You don't have the guts. You're just a weak little bitch who picked up more than he could handle in a strip club one night. You son of a Get out of here. Listen to me. Abby belongs to me. You keep your lap dog away from us. Or else next time I'll make him eat that gun. What the hell was that? Wait, we're, not, we're not talking about it here. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, I am glad you're back. I got there just in time. Where's Abby? She went back to her apartment in case Michael showed up. Okay, how'd you get one of my guns? I came in and no one was here and I took it. Okay, well, that answers my next question. Obviously, you knew you were wrong or you would ask me. Why would I ask you? So you say no? Look, Brandon is an abusive pig who treats Abby like his own personal punching bag. Now, thanks to the system, he's out on the streets. There's no way I was going to leave Abby unprotected. Okay, but you know what? As soon as you found out he was out, you should have come to me, Michael. Look, I couldn't. But you're dealing with Jake. Look, and this isn't even your problem to solve. Brandon is all mine. He's my problem to solve. You know what? I'm not going to take the gun away from you. You just go out and get another one. So I'm, I'm asking, no, you know what? I'm, I'm begging you to make the right choice on your own.
You get pulled over, you get picked up by the cops, they find that gun, you're going straight back. You know that. You do anything to Brandon at all, it's going to be the same I will result. I take my chance if it keeps Abby from being beaten or raped. Look, no, nobody blames you for wanting to protect Abby. But nobody, especially Abby, wants to see you go back to jail. Yeah, Michael, this is what I've been telling you about thinking before you react. you got to think about things. Think about your mother. How's she going to feel if you go back to prison? you got to think about your dad and your brother and your sisters. Okay, look, I understand where you're coming from, but you don't understand me. You've never been helpless like I was with Carter the way that Abby was with Brandon in the alley. Look, this is an awful feeling, Jason, to know the person who wants to hurt you has all the power. Look, I will not let Abby ever feel that way again. End of discussion. You gonna go after him? I can't. But I can't. I can't stop him from what he needs to do. I mean, I can tell him all day he's gonna protect Abby. I have to remove the problem. of it all and how I, I, if I was in Michael's position I would do the exact same thing do you really think that Michael could kill Brandon I don't really have to think it Sam I saw it you know when I found Michael in the alley his body language said it all he had made the decision to pull the trigger if I would have showed up 10 seconds later I'd... doesn't matter it's not gonna be a next time Jason, maybe there will be a next time. If not with Brandon, then with someone else. What are you saying? What do you mean, what am I saying? Michael's instincts to protect the women he loves runs really deep. He's already proven that he's going to resort to violence to keep them safe. He did it with Claudia. Now, Brandon, that doesn't just disappear. You're going to be cleaning up after his mess for the rest I, of your I, life. I told, I told Michael, after Jake's service, the best thing he can do for me is just live his life. And, and Sam, I felt like I was actually getting through to him, so if I could just get him through these next few months... Get what, I'm... Jason? What's gonna change? Well, I just feel that he needs to he needs to know what power is. He had no power at all in prison. And if, if we could just work through that, you know, he might be open to some other options. What are you gonna have to do? You're gonna have to remove all the obstacles? I'm gonna do whatever is necessary. I'm going to make sure Michael gets his chance at a decent future. <laughs>